Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Fast API. Today we are going to learn templates. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share, and comment on my video. Let's get started. Fast API itself does not provide a built-in support for rendering the HTML templates like traditional web frameworks such as Flask or the Django. Instead, Fast API focuses on building APIs. However, you can still use the Fast API with template engines like Jinja 2, any other templates engine of your choice to generate HTML responses for your web applications. So let's install the Jinja 2. And let me hide this. Control C, paste. Okay, so let's reload this. Okay, let's create the HTML with dynamic content. So index.html. So this is the dynamic content that is title and the message. Let's go and just index.html. We have in the templates index.html. Let's update it. Done. The next one that is we have to go with the using this API. Okay, copy and add this one. Here we have main.py. So let's close this. This is done. Fast AP, import fast API from the fast API and the request responses from the HTML response and the templating from the Jinja2 templates. So initialize the Jinja2 templates like this. Templates, Jinja2 template directory should be templates. Okay. Route handler for rendering the index.php. So get request response class should be HTML response. Okay. So it should be mentioned over here. Then we have an index. Okay. So the request. So what we are requesting, request title should be welcome. Okay. And the message should be hello fast API. Okay. And the template is index.html. So return templates.template response index.html. So here to pass the request title and the message. Let's try to save it and just go to the browser here. And uh, with, I think with the index we have done now slash here you can see that hello fast api the template is rendered okay in the template we have dynamically fetched the message that is title and the message okay any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video in the next video how to serve the static files in the fast api thank you so much have a great day and don't forget to like share and comment on my video have a nice day